American Airlines says the flight had a mechanical problem, had to land in Lubbock, Texas. Passengers got off the, pro the problem plane and hopped on a replacement plane. Problem solved, yes? Not exactly. The replacement plane had to then fly to Dallas for fuel. Finally, nearly 20 hours later, the 186 passengers finally landed at LAX. It was a nightmare that you can't believe. We're just happy. We're here. It's Christmas, you know, and, and uh, thank God we're here. Thank God we're here. I want to bring in Kyung Law in Los Angeles. I'm sure they had a few other things to say as well. Kyung? Uh, oh, yeah. They had an earful when they got off that flight. You know, this is the time of the year that everyone hates to travel, but you have to do it. You dread the delay. Well, these are passengers who got on that flight in Miami expecting a five-hour flight. Mid-air, Kate, there is a mechanical issue, as you said. It is forced to land in Lubbock, Texas, but they don't continue on their way. They have to move to another plane, go to Dallas to pick up fuel, and then fly to Los Angeles. They left Wednesday in the morning. They don't land until Christmas Eve at 2.15 in the morning. If you are keeping tabs on this, that is a 20-hour flight. And these passengers had plenty to say when they got off that flight. Well, it looks like we have a fire, dude. <laughs> the cabin is full of smoke. And then he reacted, called the pilot, and then all of a sudden we started going down. I started, I went back to my seat, was gagging a little bit on the smoke, and, uh, you know, it was crazy. It was an odyssey from you know where. <laughs> I just heard a noise, and I didn't know what the noise was. Somebody said they smelled smoke. I didn't. But that, that was the scariest part. And once we landed, I was just completely relieved. We're 15 hours late, and there was no sort of information from from the flight crew um, and it's just it was a bad situation all the way around not that any of these passengers care but the original flight that plane it's still stuck in Lubbock American <laughs> Airlines has reached out to all these passengers to see if they can make amends Kate